So yes, welcome to Wild Render Laboratories. Here's where we do all of our extensive testing inside of a nice, closed, measured environment. So here we go. Each of our really weird thumping beacons here. You'll see if we shoot them they do indeed absorb bullets and because we are able to separate our collision model and our look model you can see that whenever I shoot the sphere let's go somewhere here whenever I shoot the sphere that collision model is taking those bullets so you're not seeing them appear on the other side but we can shoot whenever the ball isn't there so we actually have some sort of moving cover in a way here too which I find really cool I hope you guys come up with something really nice to use for that kind of thing you also see that we have a perfect sphere inside a halo breaking all the rules we've had so far and because of our collision model we can also jump onto this thing and ride it like an elevator so these are just some of the cool little things that you can see work out with a custom scenery object it's collidable you can walk up to it hit it uh, we didn't customize any of the materials that's why it's plain white and acts like dirt which is why there are no bullet holes leaving in it so if you're wondering why no bullet holes it's because of that you can go ahead and add your own custom textures and it should behave as you expect it to okay I do believe there is one more uh, thing I'm gonna show you right after this which is how to create what is called a sound scenery object sound scenery object is just an object that emits sound but isn't visible. 